Hey there YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I want to do a slightly different review. Uh, this is Mip, and he's a little robot, uh, I guess I would say. Um, and they're extremely popular, they've been selling a lot uh, over the holidays, and it's quite an interesting piece of tech uh, for just under $100. Retails for $99.99, uh, you can get them between $80 and $100 uh, if you shop wisely online. Uh, but this is actually pretty incredible. Uh, it comes with a little stand that you can stick in it so that when it's off, it stands up. It also comes with a tray, um, kind of like a waiter's tray that, that it holds in its hands um, so that you can stack things on it and it rolls around um, with whatever you have on the tray on it. Uh, but some pretty interesting technology at work here, if my camera will focus. So I'm going to turn it on. We're going to go through some motions uh, and get you started on using this if you've got one. So uh, three batteries go in here. I believe they're triples, if I can remember correctly. There's a speaker down here. The right wheel uh, is where all the action will happen. You can actually turn the right wheel independently, uh, and that actually changes the settings, uh, which we'll get into in a second. Uh, it has some infrared lasers in the eyes. It's got an accelerometer in it uh, and some other things to help it balance. Uh, and then you've got the on switch. Uh, and when you and it kind of says it kind of grumbles at you. Um, it'll randomly talk. Um, so eyes light up uh, when it's on, and then it's kind of hard to see with my weird lighting. Uh, but his uh, little stomach down here is blue. Like I said, he randomly talks. Um, so if you put him down, he'll like, oh, he'll kind of click, uh, when you, oh boy, he's touching my mouse right now. Uh, when you put him down, he will self-balance. No, oh, he's, he's doing things on his own. So as you put him down, he kind of thinks. And he'll balance himself automatically and just kind of float there uh, once he's gained his balance. Then the next thing you need to do is get on your phone uh, and download the app for it. The app is what's really uh, impressive and gives you all the controls that you need over MIP. Now MIP does have some IR controls. You can, I'm not very good at this, but you can have him follow your hand or push back at him and he'll move like he follows my hand because I put my hand in front of his face it's kinda weird doing a little video on this uh, but you download the little MIP app Let's see if I can get that to focus uh, so it's looking for MIPS right now and it'll find mine and it'll find yours make sure that you have Bluetooth turned on this functions solely on Bluetooth low energy when you have Bluetooth turned on uh, up here on your phone it generally pulls up a list Shut up right now, MIP. Um, when you turn Bluetooth on, it normally comes up with a list of connected devices. Don't worry about that right now. Since this runs on Bluetooth low energy, it won't actually show up on that list. The MIP will really only show up here uh, in the app. And then you select it and connect. It asks, tells you that you're connecting... Sometimes takes a second. Sometimes takes a lot more than a second. Stay there, Mip. So his stomach down there has turned green. It's hard to see that he's green now. And then uh, you can drive him. So right now I'm in the drive application. I can control what he's doing. I don't have much room to work here. So I can turn him around and I can have him back up a smidge or go forward a smidge. Uh, and this, if this will focus on my phone, uh, you see the line that divides the keypad, uh, the screen, so the left half lets you drive him forward and backward. The right half will let you uh, turn him, as you can kind of see behind my phone. 
So uh, there is a camera mode where you can kind of see him through the camera uh, and you can record inside the app uh, and then this gets into a different mode. There's drive, cans, dance, boxing, path, and stack. Stack, you stack things on his little tray, which I have somehow misplaced, and he balances that accordingly. Uh, path is pretty simple. You draw a path on your phone, and then MIP will follow that. Boxing, if you have more than one MIP, you get a whole bunch of these for your kids. Um, they'll fight each other, and these uh, pulsable arms that don't actually move in the app, uh, you can have them sort of fight each other. Battle, same thing. You can challenge other MIPs head-to-head -head and see who is the last MIP standing. And if you, once he balances, if you actually knock him over without crashing him off the table... you like knock him over he'll stay knocked over he's not strong enough to pick himself back up so once he's sort of successfully knocked over if I can get him to stand again he doesn't want to stand right now technology's a little weird with these and I'll get into that in a second so there you go now he stands um, so you can do battle dance if there is music on your phone or on iTunes for iOS users, he will dance to that music in a certain way. Cans, um, there's different canisters that you can buy separately, um, and it will change how he dances and gives him a little bit of behavior. Uh, and then there's drive, uh, where you can go back to that. I'll see if I can get the dance to work. I don't know if I have any phones on here. So they have a couple different songs like Jive, Swing, Rock, and Superstar. You can change the BPM, and you can... There's kind of some defaults up here. Have him go forward, backward, spin to the right, or spin to the left. So you can have him uh, do that just by a push of a button. But I think they also have some... Uh, they also have some sounds in here, I think, that you can... Uh, start at least I thought oh no these are different dance modes that's what it is so you can have different dance styles um, but make sure you do have some music on your phone I guess I'm just gonna do I don't know like a ringtone or oh this is the default song that's on the Samsung phones so I guess I'll pick that and then he kind of dances to the song that's on the phone and I think you can kind of change how he dances if you change modes on the fly he'll dance a little bit differently and he stops when you stop the song now if you don't use the app and you're not connected to the app the way you change modes on this is by turning the wheel and then his little stomach will change colors. Uh, I think there's like five or six different colors. Red, blue, green, like a white, something else. Um, but since I'm connected on the phone, and that's the way I definitely recommend you use him. Uh, it doesn't have to be a phone, any tablet uh, or iPad or anything that your kid might have nowadays anyway. They can use to uh, connect to this. Like I say, he just randomly talks. Since I disconnected him from the app, uh, his little stomach here goes back from green to blue. Um, the technology is a little bit finicky. You saw when I tried to pick him up, he doesn't always want to stand. Um, he's really, you know, you got to like put his arms out and actually have him uh, stand. There's a lot of demos of these. Last year at some, you know, CES conventions and other electronics conventions, they would have... Uh, a whole bunch of these uh, in sort of like a playpen um, and it never really worked very well the salesmen that were there kind of demonstrating this technology always had a lot of issues with it so they are the first person to people to come to market with this yes the technology is pretty impressive that you can pack into this for a hundred bucks it's got accelerometers it's got 
you know, other pieces, gyroscopes that it uses to balance. It's got IR leads. It's got speakers into it. It's got Bluetooth modules built into it. Uh, and it has all of this pretty programmable and responsive memory that's built into it. So from a technology standpoint, pretty darn impressive. Uh, in terms of, you know, other robotics enthusiasts or other things like that, this is probably not for you. Uh, this is, you know, sort of tailored towards those uh, younger kids, you know, 12 and below maybe, uh, depending on, you know, you know your kids better than I. Um, but really, really popular. It was a huge hit over the holidays. Uh, a lot of kids like to use it, and these kids can pick it up very uh, easily. The app is very easy. It's super intuitive. It's very easy to change modes. It's very easy to control it. A lot of these kids pick that up. Uh, pretty quickly right out of the box. Um, so in the box you get this, no batteries included, slightly disappointing, the little plastic stand that you kinda you know put in underneath uh, the feet here to get it to stand up uh, and then there is uh, a tray which I don't think he holds if I remember correctly, I think it just clips on to his midsection uh, and then he can uh, hold things while he's balancing because he's smart enough um, to do that. They say in some of the commercials and other things like that that he can actually hold another MIP on top of himself, and he can, but when you actually try to move this guy with him holding another one of these, pretty difficult to do. Um, so on Amazon currently, list price is $99.99. They are almost out of stock. Um but used, uh, you can get them from 55 bucks, brand new, uh, starting at 80 bucks. Um, you can get a two pack for 140. I guess that's probably the deal there. Um, they come in black and white. Let me see here if I can go to their website, talk a little bit about that. So it's app-enabled, free app provides control and or enhanced gameplay on your smart device. Sound detection allows uh, Wowie robot to react to noises in its environment. Gesture sense, um, it says that it's based on swipes, claps, touch, and more. I wasn't able to do too much of that. Uh, from what I've seen in other demos, if you move your hand away from it, it will follow the hand. If you push your hand towards it, it will back up. So you can kind of guide it along uh, in that sense. If you do bump him, uh, let me turn it back on. If you do bump him, he will, you know, he doesn't really, oh, I've tried to drive off table here. So he doesn't really fall over. I mean, he's pretty darn resilient. I can, oh, don't, no, no, drive off the desk up there. Uh, but it definitely takes a little bit. There is a little bit of a learning curve to get used to some of the hand gestures and other things like that. It's not flawless. Let's see. There's dealers. You can get them just about anywhere. Amazon, Bed Bath & Beyond, Best Buy, Fry's Electronics, GameStop, Kohl's, Kmart, Target, Toys R Us, and Walmart. There's also a mip o which is the dinosaur version of this. Oh, let's see... Age grading, eight years and up, 90-day warranty. Release date was 2014 when this product came out. Let's see. Got the app, features, gesture sense technology, immersive personality. Does have a little bit of personality to him. I like the little goofy little noises that... Uh, he makes. That's pretty cool. Uh, Bluetooth Low Energy allows Wowie products like this guy to seamlessly connect and interact with your smart device. Um, let's see. There's some... They've been all over the news, uh, so if you haven't seen one of these yet, and this is the first video that you're watching of that, I would be pretty impressed. Um, you can actually change... Now, I didn't have this. There is a little pad that he comes with to kind of dance on. There is a rechargeable battery pack as accessories. You can actually change out the little uh, rims that he has on here. Quit talking right now, buddy. Um, and there's bigger tires. Uh, so rather than these thin tires, they've got some bigger tires uh, that come with that. And uh, rechargeable battery packs. So that's kind of cool. 
Um, but that's about it. I can't think in, think of too many other things that I would mention uh, for that. Pretty cool piece of technology. I definitely recommend it to the uh, younger generation. Definitely something that you'll want to pick up if you haven't picked up for the holidays, maybe a birthday or something like that. And I've seen these everywhere. They're hugely popular. Commercials all the time for them. Uh, they're on you know every other today show and different commercial and there's tons of ads for them all over the internet uh, but hope that was good uh, let me know like the video if you like it dislike it if you dislike it questions or comments leave in the section below I'll be around to answer them to the best of my ability uh, and if I've left anything out let me know so I can pick that up uh, in the next video I'll be using this for the next couple of weeks uh, and I'll let you know what other quirks that I might find uh, but for 100 bucks, really can't complain. It's a pretty darn cool piece of technology. It's not flawless, uh, but as a first comer to the market uh, with that sort of smart little uh, personal robot, this thing is pretty darn cool. Uh, so thanks for hanging around, guys. We will see you in the next one.